what is up youtube we are back with another dragon ball legends video but first we have a special guest appearance and it's my boy green Roof. take it away fam yeah what's good everybody uh it's green Roof here um just appreciate it for wavy for uh bring me in for this special special discussion uh what we have here wavy we have the one the only if you guys haven't if you guys have not, bro, you already know my boy Green Ruff loves, and he's known for this, Piccolo. And not only just a Piccolo, fused with Kami Piccolo is getting a Zenkai, man. Um, it's the Legends Road, and from what it says, um, Zenkai Awakened Legends Road Piccolo, the effects of his main and unique abilities will last longer, making him an even stronger supporter. And you can unlock all his unique abilities to boost his own firepower, too. So, Ruff, I'm going to let you explain that for me. So, it looks like, all right, uh, it looks like his main, like, so the stuff that he buffs, it looks like it's going to last long, which is super good. And it says that making him even stronger um stronger supporter and you can unlock all his unique abilities to boost his own firepower so reading that it makes it seem like the the other two unique abilities that we're going to get because you know zenkai they have they get four unique abilities right he mm -hmm. has two and then they're going to add two more so reading that it looks like the two other unique abilities look like it might give him you know damn deflected buffs to himself when he goes to the battlefield like say for example he might come into battlefield and do like you know 30 percent damage deflected every time he comes into the battlefield because one thing about this pickle that he's lacking is actually damage. Yeah, like they were saying, damage like uh, inflicted buffs for himself when he uh, lands attack. Because mostly um, the buffs, the buffs that he has now is for his allies. So they want to give him damage inflicted buffs so he can do some damage as well. So that's what I got from the tweet. Yeah, reading the uh, like you said, reading it, it just basically it says like the effects of his main unique abilities will last longer, making him. It just basically shows that they're gonna make him viable and actually pack a punch with his. Yep. You we already know with the uh, Zenkai's and get, unlocking all their uniques, they really hit. Um, looking at his kit, um, obviously they don't have it Ooh. now. Um, yeah, one of the things that um that uh other people who've had him and especially rough it's his main ability to give that 35 for um damage for allied regen legends road oh. now that was one of the main things that i noticed about him and he also inflicts enemy with the downgrade for 30 percent damage receives for 20 counts and he cancels enemies attribute upgrades and he only needs 15 counts for that to pass i rough i'm gonna i'm gonna just let you touch on on touch on his oh. kid fam yeah, the 35 damage inflicted buff is really good. Really, really good. And even in the tweet, it says that the effects of the main and unique abilities will last longer. So that mm -hmm. means they're going to make the time accounts longer for this, which is pretty insane because 25 is already good, but they're going to make it longer. And then Aflex then, uh, actually downgraded 30% damage received. So you're giving your ally 35% damage inflicted, and you're making the enemy take 30% 30, 30 more damage. So that's a 65 like damage net for you. So that means you're actually going to do 65% damage. Mm -hmm. And the cancels enemy attribute upgrade is really, really, it's a really slept on ability because um, in my video, he can really, he can, he can honestly counter a last stand Gohan because when Gohan pops his main, main ability, he gets all the buffs, but his buffs are cancelable. You can actually cancel his buffs. And this Piccolo, if you play him right, you could actually stop Gohan. If you pop his main ability when you when they're facing up against you, say for example, you're beating down a Sun Family team, and it's like say you have him and a blue unit, and Gohan pops it, you know he gets all these buffs. You bring in Piccolo, pop his main ability, he cancels all of Gohan's buffs, and basically Gohan is just not going to do as much damage. So that's really slept on is that cancel enemy attribute right there. Mm -hmm. That's one of the things that I <laughs> discussing with Ruffin is like, man, to, to be able just for him to be able to knock somebody's buffs right off is like one of the one of the most scariest things. So thinking your team is stacked, you stacked up all your damage just for it to get knocked off and keep his damage inflicted still going out throughout the whole entire game is gonna be nasty. And the worst thing is he is a support unit and him doing this much damage is not fair. <laughs> Right. It's not fair. Um, obviously, I don't have him. Um, as you guys can see, it I, I I didn't grind his event. Shame on me. Um, um, is there any uniques in his unique abilities? Do you want to see changed, or how do you want to go about that? 
<sighs> change like right night. Oh my gosh. The abilities he have now is really, really good. First of all, he short his own sub count by two. I think that's really slept on. You can bring him in as like quickly as possible with reduced sub count. Even though two might not seem a lot, uh, that actually can really help you out because you know if he can come into the battlefield as fast as possible, you can really just keep uh, switching him out and keep racking those damage afflicted buffs. That's really good. Mm -hmm. But also he also has death buffs as well, similar to like how Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, the purple one, or even say Death Gohan, like the Yellow Future Gohan. He gives damage afflicted to his allies. And he also increases card draw speed by 30 for your other allies. Now, if they make it where they take out the 30 time counts and make it a permanent thing, like for the rest of the battle, Ooh. that might be scary. Because LF's like, say, say, for, uh, say for example, LF Piccolo, right? Mm -hmm. You do a yellow, yellow, blue team. LF Piccolo gets uncancelable card draw speed for a certain time accounts when he transforms. And say this dude dies, LF Piccolo <sighs> will have permanent. <laughs> level two card draw speed <laughs> oh my god with reduced card oh my god Ella Piccolo and anybody like this guy will be really good if they take the time accounts away from this which is really scary you know I, I actually was shaking my head thinking about that like man just I was thinking about a Vegeta in a sense because even though you're dying but it's it's a worse buff because you're getting your you're getting your card draw it's gonna and, and, it's, and you're getting your stack so basically yep. if you really think about it well obviously card draw means you can farm a rush let's say you already you already farmed your first rush yeah. if you have him still on the battlefield which most likely it will since he's going to be having a zenkai if he dies bro you can farm a second rush more quickly than usual yeah. Yeah. oh my yeah. god this guy is gonna be super valuable because like even his other abilities like um we switch to standby his other ones and the mecha willpower is like 30 percent to blast damage 30 percent to key recovery Mm -hmm. And if they're also regen or legends road, he gets 30% strike damage and restores health by five. So this is already good enough uh, right here. Like, I honestly don't think they can really change it up. Like, maybe make it a little bit longer. I guess that's what they said in the thing. The unique abilities, supports are going to last longer. <laughs> so these time accounts might increase to maybe 20, I, I'm assuming. And yeah, like these two, these two abilities right here is already good. Yeah, they might give it. I'm not gonna say the pearly treatment. Only, only saying like when his kit before Zenkai, I believe his kit was like 15 counts, and they extended it five extra counts more. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, to to you guys, they might not seem like a lot, but to to us, that's a lot. And when you get your counts extended that much, it's just a little bit to help the unit, and that goes really far, man. I see this unit as being a very his main ability is just what freaks me out and looking at his now looking at his other uniques for for regen and legends road it just scares me anymore because he's just a damage buffer stack that's all he's doing at this point and having him die is just like oh well he, he's just gonna keep buffing the team um right. and then also i want to say is think about like this is really going to help region i think it's going to help region out he's going to help region out more than uh, legends road and i'm going to tell you why so Think about all the good teams that you have in this matter, right? You have God Keep. One of the reasons why God Keep's super good is Vados. Vados is a support. She's amazing, right? Mm. Think about Sun Family. Yellow Goten is a support, right? Mm. Um, super Saiyan. Like, Bardock isn't really a support. You know, he's not a support. That's not his type, but he has that Super Saiyan crits, right? <laughs> crits. Future. Think about Purple, Super Saiyan, Blue, uh, Vegeta, right? He has the support and everything. Reduce sub, uh, subs, uh, time account. And then when he dies, he gives death buff and heals and reduce Dragon Balls, right? Yeah. So Regen really doesn't have a support. Now, a lot of people might say 21 is, but the thing with 21, the blue 21, is that, like, most of our things depends on certain, like, tag. Like, girls get certain buffs, transfer warriors get certain buffs. This guy is really for Legends Road and Regen. And the fact that Regen is actually going to get someone that's, a, like, a dedicated support unit that actually going to get, make them deal more damage is actually really scary. And I think that's what Reason was really lacking. And you guys are going to really see Reason hit even harder. Yeah. The, especially his tag only focusing on two tags. It's literally Reason and Legends Road. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. knowing Ruff, I'm pretty sure he's going to run a ne do the Namekian showcase when something. Uh -huh. You guys stay tuned for that. Um, Something that something that's gonna be really scary to see regen come off, and especially having DKP, the other Piccolo, and of course this guy right here having this, he's gonna be a really nasty unit. And I don't, I tell you guys now, if you guys haven't, bro, 
if you guys haven't, make sure you guys Zenkai him when he comes out because this guy don't sleep on him at all. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And then, like, I guess if they, the only thing I guess they could probably do to make him as a better support is when he switches out, gives the other, give his other allies key. They give him that. If they just give him that, you know, and other the one of the other two passes, like maybe he gets key when, like, you know how Vados does, like every time she comes in, she gets key. Every time she switches out, she gives key. Yeah. Like if he has something like that. This guy, this guy is probably the this pro this guy is probably going to be the most valuable region unit that uh, region has because um, he's going to give buffs even when he dies. He's going to have some type of way of impacting the game for your team. This guy has it all, in my opinion. I really feel like. <laughs> this guy is really good. Um, one thing I was hearing around, obviously, his ki his well, this little kit um, from boosting his stats from what Twitter gave out for a little bit. Hearing that there's a he well, obviously another yellow unit. Um, people are saying, what are you gonna what What would you sacrifice to have to have to run him? Are you gonna run? Um, yeah. Who Who would I sacrifice? Because like, yeah, that's one of the biggest things with Regent is these three yellow units, right? Um, you have DKP. You have this guy, and then you have Ella Piccolo. Mm -hmm. Now, I really feel like it. De it really depends on how you play, right? Because Ella Piccolo, that that region setup for Ella Piccolo is, is the one where you draw out the game, right? You kind of want to be like it's like the war of attrition, right? You kind of want to just uh, last longer than your uh, than your opponents, right? You kind of want to use Boo to heal. You kind of want uh, Piccolo as the game, you know, progresses, he gets stronger, right? Mm -hmm. So um, you, you can use that region and you can use that Piccolo on there. So then you can use two yellows on that team. But, or you can actually use a fast paced one where you might use DKP, you know, like, you know, his car draw speed. You can attack, you can, you can uh, just attack, attack, get his uh, Dragon Balls, Rise and Rush, then pop his main and get the other one. And uh, you could put him there, and then you could put him with Kid Boo, where they actually do more damage. It's like you know, it's fast paced. They can keep up with this type of meta that you have here. Yeah. So um, honestly, he could fit on two different regions. I feel like um, it depends on your play style, right? If you're more of someone like you just want to do a lot of damage every time you you get a chance to, you might want to have to take away a left Piccolo and put this guy in because. I feel like a support character eat for any type of those like those teams like the one that's you know a little bit slow pace or fast pace is really going to help. So um, yeah, I really feel like if you're a fast pace, you want to drop you know LF Piccolo. If you're slow pace, you want to drop DKP and add this guy. In my opinion, <laughs> I just see support tankiness and literally. Literally, I just see nonstop. You might as well say car yeah. draw. So um, I, I see yeah. a couple rushes going to be coming out. But this unit is going to be really nice, rough, um, honestly. Yeah. And just now, just looking at his kit already, some people will say, "Oh, well, he it's an age. He's aged, and he, even aged units still have impressive kits." So sure. look at Fury Broly. He aged. He he aged bad, but he still had a very impressive kit. So um. And then, oh. No, you go uh, ahead. I was about to say. And also, if you guys think like his stats not gonna be okay because you know he's a support type, so they usually don't get that much good stats, right? They usually have the lower end of the stick. He can get triple Zenkai on a region team or double Zenkai, you know what I'm saying? Like you could pair him up with LF Piccolo and DKP and himself that's gonna get a Zenkai buff to himself. But that's three Zenkai buffs that you can't have. And you could run a yellow, yellow, blue. Uh, regen team, you know, you could run like you know, Kid Boo with Android 21, and then maybe uh, even the second form EXL, you could do a yellow, yellow, blue team like that, and you can really stack up the Zenkai buffs on him right there. Um, he, he, he has ways to get stat buffs, you know, Zenkai buffs, you know, two or uh, two other yellow regen units can, can make them even more tankier and hit harder. So that's what yeah. pe that's what people always forget is the Zenkai buffs, <laughs> yeah, bro. Like, and it really plays like people don't understand how much zenkai's of like zenkai buffs actually make a character like gohan without zenkai seven trunks is a whole different breed <laughs> he's a whole different breed a whole different breed all right you guys that's gonna conclude this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe for more content don't forget to check out russ video he also posted his discussion of how he feels about that unit it's on his channel link will be in the description down below rough i'm gonna let you send this one off man yeah, man. Uh, appreciate Wavy for having me here. You know, Piccolo, man. You know, the, you know, he had to bring me in. So I really appreciate Wavy. Definitely subscribe to this man, bro. He's trying to uh, grow his YouTube channel. He's already killing it on Twitch. So the fact that uh, he just started YouTube is super dope to me. 
and definitely uh yeah definitely subscribe to both of us bro we're just trying to grow we're just having a good time and everything and yeah man like comment subscribe it's big boy gruff man and wavy and we out we out peace, peace.